We're not accepting no fake love, no fake peace, no fake joy. Everything that God is sending my way and your way, he said this word to me as I was driving, healthy. It's going to be healthy. Healthy love, healthy joy, healthy peace. When something is healthy, it's good for you. Mm -hmm. Watch this. God wants you to be healthy in your mind, in your body, in your soul, in your spirit. God wants you to be healthy physically, emotionally, spiritually. Okay? God said in 3 John, I believe, 1 and 2, he said, Beloved, he said, I wish up of all things. Matter of fact, he said, I wish, he said, I pray that you prosper and be in good health. Good health is shata. The peace. He's this ain't I don't want you with the peace to where you got you got a situation going on and you going through something and you gotta go do something so it can bring ease to what you're going through. But later on you gotta pay for it. But what you gotta pay for it with is gonna deal with your peace. Ah, Shata. God say that's not what I'm talking about. God say I want you in a place in me a place in god to where it is a healthy peace a healthy joy a healthy love nothing missing nothing broken agape unconditional unwavering unmoving set in stone established from the foundation of the whole shot listen god said healthy i'm telling you clear as that he said healthy healthy joy Healthy peace. Healthy love. I just heard healthy. When something is healthy, it's good for you. When something is healthy, when something is healthy, it is absent from sickness, infirmities, and disease. Meaning, this thing won't puss up on you later. Shut up. This thing won't show itself later. This thing won't seem to be something and then show another face later. Shut up. This thing ain't coming as a mask. It is what it is. Oh, shut up. God said, I'm going to show you what it is and you got to take it for what I show you. I'm going to show you for what it is and you got to take me at my word. You can't second guess this thing because so is the man thinking, so is he. And you'll be putting things on top of something that I didn't call it what it is. I've already called it what it is. I already said what it shall be. You got to take me at my word. I showed it to your son. I showed it to your daughter. God said, health. I want you healthy mentally, emotionally, physically, spiritually, mind, body, soul, and spirit. I want you whole. It reminds me of when, when, when the lepers were, were sick. Uh huh. It, 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 and it also reminds me of the woman with the issue of blood. Uh huh. They both watch this. They one was sick, one had an issue. One was had the, the one that had the issue was also sick, and the one that was sick had the issue too. But the Bible said that the one, the woman with the issue of blood, watch this. God said when she touched the hem of his garment, he said, "Your faith has made you whole." The, I, I, I was coming to be healed, but my fate made me whole. The story with the lepers, when the when he said, um, one came back to say thank you. He said, was there not 10 of you? Where are the other nine? But watch this. They left, and as they went, watch this, as they went, they were healed. But somebody with gratitude came back to the master to say thank you. His perspective was different. His gratitude was different. Maybe he sat down long enough while he was in his mess. And maybe he sat down while he was in his mess long enough saying, Lord, if I could just get out this and I ain't going to go back to this and I ain't going to go back to that. And for God to come show himself 
strong in your situation and circumstance. How dare you not come back to say thank you? But he did come back to say thank you. But he was not just healed. He was whole. Mm. So God said, in the midst of you, working that thing out, getting getting what you need for your mind to get right, getting what you're doing, what you need to do going forward to get your physical, your body right, getting what you need and, and releasing what you need to release and, and sitting on whoever sofa you need to sit on and talking to whoever you need to talk to and crying as long as you need to cry and spare not as long as you need to spare not for your emotions to be where it needs to be and fasting. And praying long enough to where you before God, to where God just destroyed the yoke of the bondage of the enemy. Hold out of the Mashiach and allow you to be free indeed. Because he who the sun set free, who shot out, he got the keys. It's free indeed. Hold out of the Mashiach. Life and life more abundantly. That's what you came to give, Father. Listen, listen, healthy. And if it ain't healthy, if it ain't healthy, you don't want it. Oh, shut up. If it, if it ain't ease and peace and joy and graciousness, and if it ain't God, you don't want it. Because I promise you, it got another day for another face. And God said, tell them, healthy. I received that for myself. And I released it unto you. God said, healthy in all areas, mind, body, and soul, be healthy.